Namaste from Joy of Reading. Today's story is My Big Family. The author is Luru Thi Lurong. The illustrator is Le Thi An Tu. Translator is Alicia Berger and the publisher is Room to Read. Family means a group of people related to each other like parents, grandparents, aunts, uncle. And this story is some child's big family. Bin has a big family. So Bin, you can see so many people here, right? He has a big family. This is everyone. One, grandma. Two, grandpa. Three, Bin and cat. Four, aunt. Five, Uncle, six, baby, seven, parents. So this is everyone in his family, his grandma, grandpa, this is Bin. And then this is his aunt, uncle, the baby is also there and his mother and father. There are too many people. Bin has nowhere to play. Since there are so many people in the house, he doesn't have a place to play. At last, his family takes their afternoon nap. So at last in the afternoon, all of them take a short nap or sleep. They go to sleep in the afternoon. Cat gets the yarn. Now Bin and Cat can play. So yarn is this big piece of thread here. So the cat gets this yarn. And Bin and the cat can play now together. It is so much fun. They're having a lot of fun. Joy, see how happy they are. They're playing. Crash. Uh-oh. But suddenly something happens. Something falls. What is it? The baby cries. Mom scolds Bin, Dad scolds Bin, even Grandpa scolds Bin. So with all that noise, something crashing, the sound wakes up the baby and the baby is crying. So what happens to Bim? His mom scolds him, Dad and even Grandpa, all the three of them get angry with him and scold him. Why did you do that like that, right? Bin talks back. I have no place to play. This house is too small. I have too big a family. So Bin doesn't keep quiet. He talks back and he says, I have no place to play here. This house is so small. I have a big family. Where can I play? Bin cries loudly. Bin cries softly. Bin falls asleep. So he's crying loudly here, see? And then after that, it reduces and he cries softly. Not much sound is coming. And then after that, he starts to sleep. He falls asleep. Bin wakes up. The house seems strange. So he then wakes up. And there's something wrong with the house. What is wrong? Let's see. There's no baby, no mom, no grandma. So he cannot find anyone there. No baby, his mom is not there, his grandmother is not there. So where is everyone? There is no grandpa, no dad, no uncle or aunt. So even his grandpa, dad, uncle, aunt, they're all not there. So. The house, why it is feeling strange? Because it is quiet now. There is no noise. And it's kind of different for him. Because no one is there. Bin is home alone. This is great. So Bin now is happy. There's no one at home. So he can play wherever he wants to. Make a lot of noise. He's so happy. Suddenly, it is dark. What happened? So now, suddenly, all the lights are gone out. It is dark. What happened? 
the sky flashes, the ground rumbles. Where is everyone? So you can see lightning is coming from the sky. Do doom sound, the thunder sound is coming and the ground is like shaking. Where is everyone? Look at Bin. He's like this, scared, afraid. Bin hears rain. Then he hears mom and his grandparents and the baby. So now you can see the rain is coming. He can hear the sound of the rain. And after that, he hears his mom as well, his grandparents and the baby too. He's able to hear their sounds. It keeps raining. Then dad is home. Uncle and aunt are home too. Everyone is wet. So now everyone comes back home. Uncle, aunt, dad, everyone comes and it is still raining. So everyone is wet because of the rain falling on them. Bin feels safe now. Sometimes it is nice to have a big family. So Bin now feels safe. He's no longer afraid because there are so many people around him. So isn't it nice to have a big family because all of these people are there to support you and help you. And he can always play outside. So what if his family is inside the house? He can always go outside and play, right? It is nice to have a big family. I hope you enjoyed this story with me. Thank you. Some of the difficult words in the story are scold, to speak angrily to somebody because he or she has done something bad or wrong. Rumbles, to make a deep, heavy sound. Nap, a short sleep that you have during the day. Strange, unusual. Try these. Who is there with you in your family? Do you like to live with a big family? Have you felt sometimes that you cannot play when there are too many people in the house?